What is going on? We are gonna take a look at a trailer that dropped a couple days ago, and it is called C, and it's got Jason Momoa in it. So Aquaman, I'm a big Jason Momoa fan, and um, I'm a huge DC fan, so I think he's great as, as uh, Aquaman, so I'm excited to take a look at this. Now, before we get into it, don't forget to like, big like, thumbs up on this video, it does help a lot, subscribe, all that good stuff. Now. It's the official trailer, it's Apple TV Plus. So I guess they're coming out with a streaming service. What media company isn't, right? We got Disney, Apple, who's owned by Disney, Netflix, you name it. I mean, it's all about the streaming services. So let's get into it going in. Three, two, one, let's get it. I have no idea what I'm walking into. Oh, the trailer before the trailer. The moment has come. Mmm, it's pretty. Centuries from now, almost all humans have lost the ability to see. Oh, interesting. Some say sight was taken from them by God. Hmm. How do you operate? But after so many years, the power of sight has returned. What is it? It's you, Brent. It's you, Brent. You have the ability to see. How would you know that? <laughs> hmm. Especially when they're babies. I get it. It's like, Dad, look, you see how beautiful that is? That we would call magical. But how would you know that? You must protect them. Centuries, we feared this day would come. The evil of light once almost destroyed the world. And now it has returned. Find the children who can see and bring them to me. Oof. Not good. Oh, classic Jason and Moa. If we get the baby, they might leave us alone. No, I stand with Bubba Bob. These children are a gift. They will bring knowledge. They will begin a new world. We are family. We are one. And we fight as one. Oh. first this is interesting I love that they're coming from a creative angle because I'm tired of remakes reruns sequels of prequels and just telling the same stories over and over again so I'm excited to see something new the premise doesn't make a lot of sense I, I I'm not convinced that having sight ruins the planet uh, maybe over the course of millions of years we evolve we grow in technology we're able to innovate and create some spectacular things that helps our lives but ruins the earth so i could see where they're coming from but i would argue that you know um technology does do a lot of good for humanity allows us to thrive allows us to become uh, it, when you use it properly it allows us to become better versions of ourselves when used improperly of course it does not but uh, it allows us to expand what we think is possible, and I think that's a good thing. And so living in your own filth, running around with spears, not having any clean, fresh water, besides maybe a stream, assuming you're nearby one, and uh, not having the technology that allows you to thrive properly, I don't see that being uh, much better than, uh, than the latter. So, um, but maybe, uh, maybe I'm misreading it, so you can let me know in the comments. But uh, I find this super interesting. I don't know if the acting's gonna be great. It kind of comes across like a B, B movie or 
I think this is supposed to be a TV show. Let me uh, let's see here. I don't even know. Okay, so in the far future, so it is a virus, um, decimated humanity. Okay, Baba Voss, interesting name. Uh, father of two twins, must protect the tribe against a powerful yet desperate queen who believes it's witchcraft and wants them destroyed. Interesting. The other thing is, if they can't see, it kind of implies that their other senses have been heightened through evolution, right? So uh, they can hear really well and they can smell really well. If those things are able to, you know, become more valuable for that individual, why can't you make the argument that eventually, if you continue to evolve that ability, it'll be no different than the sight that they've already lost? So I find that interesting. So another way to argue the premise of this, of this movie or TV show. But maybe I'm an idiot. Could be true. Probably is true. Don't listen to me. Listen to you. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Helps a lot. And if you didn't like the video, let me know in the comments. Uh, I don't really give a shit, but it's always nice to hear feedback. So I'll see you in the next one. We're going for... Couple thousand subscribers, 10,000 subscribers specifically, help me get there, yeah!